this Ruby voice quick start covers both inbound and outbound phone calls, but for both of those we need a phone number, so let's go get one. We'll start in the console and search for a 215 number, and I'll grab the first Philadelphia area phone number I find. I'll click buy, buy this number, and then setup number. We'll come back to number setup later. Let's start by talking about outbound calls. Your app makes a post request to Twilio. Twilio places a call to your phone. When the call is connected, Twilio requests some Twimmel instructions from your application. If the Twimmel looks like this, then Twilio speaks some text back to your phone. Let's write some code to make that work. We'll start in the terminal by using Bundler to create a new gem file, and in there we'll include the Twilio Ruby helper library. Then we'll head back to the terminal and use Bundler to install the Twilio Ruby helper library. Then we'll create a makecall.rb file. In here, the first thing we'll do is pull in the helper library from Bundler. Then we'll declare our account credentials. This is our Twilio account, account SID and auth token values. These look like this, but I have these stored in environment variables for safekeeping, and I recommend you do as well. So we'll fetch those from environment variables. Then we'll use those credentials to create a Twilio REST client object. Next, we'll use the REST client to create a phone call. The two phone number will be my phone number. Phone numbers are formatted like this, but I guess what? Have mine stored in an environment variable. The from phone number will be the Twilio phone number that we purchased from the numbers console. And the URL will be a URL that Twilio will reach out to for some Twimmel instructions. That's going to be demo.twilio.com slash docs slash voice.xml. We'll head back to the terminal and run our code to make the phone call. Thanks for trying our documentation. Enjoy. That's great, Twilio. Who doesn't love a Rickroll? Let's check out the Twimmel to see how that happened. There's a say that does text-to-speech and reads out, thanks for trying our documentation, enjoy. And then a play tag that plays that lovely, classic Rickroll MP3. Now let's talk about inbound calls. User places a phone call to your Twilio number. Twilio makes an HTTP request to your app, which returns some Twimmel. And if the Twimmel looks like this, then Twilio speaks some text back to the user. Let's write the server code to make that happen. We'll start by updating our gem file to include not just the Twilio Ruby helper library, but also the Sinatra web framework. Head back over to the terminal and use Bundler to install the Sinatra web framework. And then we'll create a server file called app.rb. Inside of here, we'll use Bundler to pull in both the Twilio Ruby helper library and the Sinatra web framework. And then we'll create a post route on slash voice where Twilio will request some Twimmel from when a call comes in. When that request comes in, we'll respond with a voice response that'll use text-to-speech to say, hello from your pals at Twilio, have fun. We'll return the string representation out of this route, head back and use bundler to run app.rb. It'll start a server on localhost port 4567. We'll create an ngrok tunnel to allow Twilio to reach our localhost code. That gives us a publicly addressable URL that we can copy from here and take to our Twilio phone number and paste it into the a call comes in webhook adding slash voice. We'll save it, and once everything is saved, I can pull out my phone and make a phone call to our Twilio phone number. Hello from your pals at Twilio. Have fun. We will have fun, Twilio, because now we know how to make and receive phone calls in our Ruby applications.